Good evening, everyone. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Very good. Good evening, teacher. Excellent. Nice. Okay. Three people are present. Okay, excellent. How was your weekend? Did you have a good Very weekend? Good. Excellent. Nice. Okay. Excellent. That's nice. That's yes. good. I'm glad to hear it. Okay. Let's begin. Buenas noches, este es el Programa Nacional de Inglés para el Trabajo, modalidad online, Beginner 3. Welcome to your English class. Today is Monday, March the 27th, and this is class 16. Hotel services and amenities. Hotel services and amenities. This is the general objective. This is the specific object. And this is the class objective. <clears throat> the class will be able to plan a trip and talk about travel services and accommodations they need to prepare their trip. In the agenda, we have traveling, hotel amenities, hotel services, hotel reservation, and discount. Okay. Now we're six people. So, well, someone is still connecting. Okay, we're seven, which is great. Okay. Okay. Let's begin with attendance. Alison Andrea Serran. Present teacher. Excellent. Anna Geraldine Mena. Present. Excellent. Barbara Susana Rivas. Blanca Flor Jiménez. Blanca Flor, no. Carla Jasmine Rivera. Carlos Jonathan Garcia. Daniel Ernesto Membreño. Present. Excellent. Denis Fernando Flamenco. Edwin Mauricio Pineda. Gilberto Benito Santa Maria. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Jose Andrés Martínez. Katy Briseida Hernández. Present teacher. Excellent. Noé Gustavo Núñez. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Olga Tatiana Portillo. Present teacher. Okay, excellent. Oliver Van Trigueros. Omar Alexander Chávez. Roberto Carlos Gámez. Present teacher. Excellent. 
Rolando Danilo Sánchez. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Salvador Alberto Sorian. Susana Andrea Urbina. Present teacher. Excellent. William Boris Rock. Hey. Um, <clears throat> I'm not going to say anything because you are the ones that are always present. So the people that need to hear something are the ones that are absent, but they are not here. So there are some people that have uh, their numbers are very low. They don't get the 10%. So they don't get their 10%. Some people have uh, 39%, 48%, 42%. Okay. Okay, but we have some people that have the 70%. Okay, like Allison, Don Gilberto has 70%. Okay, only, only two people have two per 70%. Then there are some others with 65% and 64. Ah, there is one with 69. Rolando, okay, 69%. That's good. Then with 65 and 64, And 62. But the others, they have this week to get the 25% that they need to get at least 80, barely 80. So I hope that they can make it. But like I say, you don't need to hear this because you are in, the, your numbers are okay. But the other people, they're in trouble. Let's see, let's continue. <clears throat> Warm up, traveling. <clears throat> the purpose is to discuss traveling. You say, teacher, we have tra discussed travel traveling before. Yeah, okay. This is, a, this island here is the Gran Canaria. That's the name of this island, the Gran Canaria. Okay. So this is the beach at Gran Canaria. Okay. And this is Germany. Okay. This is Germany. Okay. Let me see the other picture. This is, you guess, what is this? Yes, my dear Angelitos, just by the monument, what city is this? Okay, Phil. This is the Eiffel Tower, yes. So what city is it? Paris. Yeah, it's Paris, exactly. Okay. So in the first one, we're going to discuss these questions. Who do you, okay, why do people travel? What are its benefits, okay, the benefits of traveling? Why can most people travel? What do you take on a trip? Do you like traveling alone? Do you like traveling on business? Have you ever traveled on business? So these are the questions that you need to discuss in the groups. Okay, well, I will not answer. Okay, let's see. So Angelitos, 
let's go to the groups and uh, let's be. Okay. Now we have 15 present. I'm going to make, um, I don't know how many people that are inactive are. They say listeners, but they are inactive. So uh, I will say, I'm going to make three groups. Let's see if it works out that way. The groups are opening, please join. Hola. Hola. ¿Quién nos está compartiendo? Good evening. Yo. Excelente. Thank you. Okay. To discuss traveling. You may you may turn off your camera then. Hoy. You may turn off your camera because. Eh, sí, me está fallando. No sé si es el internet. I think it's the internet. Mejor la pago. Yeah, it's all right. No problem. Not right now it's okay, but you are sharing, so maybe that's why. But right now it's okay. So. Okay. Thank Why? Why do people travel? But. Yeah, I think we travel... can be happy. No sé. The people travel to vacation. Vacation. That's right. I people... think so. The people travel for business, uh, people. for vacation. I think so. For family. Yes. Yes. What is the benefit? The pen. It's the pen because if if people travel for for business, uh, the ben the what are the benefits? And um, now, uh, the benefits. Can can be money and in other in other business. The it, benefit uh, to benefit is is money for business. If if the people travel for for family, for vacation, the benefits benefit is relax, enjoy. I think so. Yes. Other Why? opinion? Um, no. Olga? Para conocer, es que no sé cómo se dice este, diferentes culturas. Este es uno de los beneficios. Puede, puede uno conocer diferentes culturas. Different culture. Different culture. No, no. To learn, different, different learn culture. about to learn about different cultures. Yes. To learn about, to different, learn cultures. about different cultures. To learn about different cultures. Okay, number three. Why can't what is anything? What is the benefit? Eh? The benefits exactly
what what are brand names Okay. What are the benefits you are rather? Uh -huh. Benefits are posi harm. positive things. Hmm. Positive things about traveling. Positive things travel. You relax the people, the people, verdad? People relax, yeah. Divorce. People relax. They get divorced. No. Divorce. No. I relax to uh, uh, drink beers. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh, okay. Pick up the plane. <laughs> Distract to get distracted. Uh huh. The chili compartir con la familia. The compartir share share with family. Share family. Share no share with family. Yeah, share with family. Share with family. Share with family. Uh -huh. Number three, why can most people travel? Ahí como que sería... Yeah. Porque mucha gente viaja. Yeah. For, for lack of What money. Can most people travel. Okay. Why for can't? Lack? No. Why can't most people travel? Why is it impossible for some people to travel? They don't have money. Mm -hmm. They don't have time. Uh -huh. What else? Work, también podría ser. Por mucho trabajo. They are love busy. Work. Uh -huh. They don't have time. Uh -huh. They don't have time. Yeah. Por voluntari, falta de voluntad. Ah, because they don't want. They don't want, okay. Salieron buenas, yo así las mandé. Porque no tenía fe. No tenía fe, pero las oraciones no le salieron bien. <risa> no me estaba escuchando el <risa> yes, of course. Todavía tenemos todavía tenemos pendientes algunas cosas de una plataforma. Cabal. Continue. Sí, I was checking the weekend. I was checking on the weekend, but this week. I have to check every day. This week, because it's the last week, I have to check every day. And uh, update everything that you do, I update. Mm -hmm. Finish discussing. 
Yes. Yes, yes. teacher. Yes. Yeah. Okay. okay, good. Then continue talking about your faith yeah. and the prayers, the prayers and the faith. Okay, so let's see. Once a month, once a month. One a week per month. Once a month or once a week? Una vez no. al mes. Once a month. Una semana. Once al mes. Once a month. A one ma one week. week a month. Yes. One week a month. Una vez a la semana. Digo una, una vez, vez al mes. mes. Una vez al mes. Ajá. Decide. <laughs> one week a month is una, toda una semana durante un mes. No. Una vez al mes. Once a month. Once a month. Once a month. Once a month. Ah, ok. Eso solo es una vez al mes. Once sí. a month. Once a month. Ah, good. A month. Ok. Eh, number seven. Have you ever traveled on business? Yes, I traveled on business. Uh, me too. I I travel. I have I have traveled on business. I travel to San Salvador, and I remember the company pay pay for everything. For everything, yeah, pay for everything. For, for the sodas and the lunch and everything. Yes. yes. Uh, and for me, I think so is it's very good. It's very good because I I am uh, I was working and the company pay for everything. Lunch, break, all good, very good. That's nice. Okay, yes. excellent. Let's go to the next point. So let's go to the principal group. Okay. Okay, okay teacher. There are seven people out. Let's wait for the others. Eight. Okay. Everybody's out now. Okay, what you're going to do is match, connect. Where did you go? Why did you go? Where did you stay? How long did you stay? Did you go alone? What did you see? Who did you meet? What did you eat? What did you drink? Did you have a good time? When did you come back? How much did you spend? And the answers, the answers are, I stayed at the, at the Grand Hyatt Berlin. I ate Henningsberg Klopse. Teacher, what is that? Meatballs. Uh, what do you say? In, um, I forget the name in Spanish, but. People say tortita de carne. 
with a cream, some a type of cream that they make. So Kenigsberg Klopse is, what do they call the tortita de carne? Ladies? Albondigas. Albondigas. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay, so Kenigsberg, Kenigsberg Club, Kenigsberg Club say is Albondigas. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, I drank fast browse, far browse. Okay, fast browse is um, if a is a type of soda. Is a type of soda okay. with with uh, sparkling water, mineral water. Uh -huh. Soda mm -hmm. with mineral water is is uh, from Germany, especially from Germany. That is okay. fast browse. So I went to Germany. I was on vacation. I stayed for two weeks. I came back last week. I didn't meet anybody in particular. I spent a thousand dollars. No, I went with my family. Yes, it was great. Okay, now, what do you have to do? Match, connect. Okay. I went to Germany. I went to Germany. Where did you go? I went to Germany. But don't worry, you're going to do it in the groups. So let's go to the groups and let's do it there. So the, join the groups. La uno era con la D. La uno? Con la D. B. In English, please, you can say B. one and D. Okay. One, one y and D. D. Mm -hmm. Why did you go? Why did you go? To e. e. I was on vacation. I was on vacation. Where Number did three. you stay? You stay. Where did you stay? Where a, did you a, stay? I stay at the Grand Hat Berlin. How long did you stay? If I stay for two weeks. <clears throat> yes. Did you go alone? No, I went with my family. What did you do? What did you see? Eight. I didn't meet anybody in particular. <laughs> I was on vacation. I I was on vacation because I was on vacation. vacaciones. Tomó vacaciones. Yes, yes. I was I was on vacation. Where do you say stay? Where did you stay? Donde se quedó, verdad? Mm -hmm. stay, no stay Spanish, Don, Don Gilberto. No Spanish. I stayed at uh, the, the Grand... Uh, Grand Hyatt Berlin. Hey, Berlin. Yeah, I Grand, I Grand Hyatt Berlin. Okay. Grand Hyatt Berlin. Uh, 
How long do, do you stay? How long do you stay? Como que fue larga su estadía, ¿verdad? No Spanish, don Gilberto. No Spanish. No Spanish. Oh. No, quiero ver este. The same verb. The answer has the same verb. Stay, stay. Yes. Uh, stay for two weeks. Stay for two weeks, right? Week. Letter X. F. Letter X. X. Did you go alone? Alone? ¿Cómo se pronuncia ahí? Alone? Did you go alone? Alone. Did you go alone? No. I didn't meet anybody in particular. Did you go alone? Mm, uh, no, I went with my no, family. I went with my family. Better mm -hmm. let give it. What did you drink? Sí, I man. drank frambois. Yes. Uh -huh. Sí. Yes. Sí. I drank. Where is the bruise? A good time. Did you, did you have? <coughs> did you have a good time? Eh, ¿Cuánto? ¿Cómo cuánto tiempo estuviste? Sí, uh -huh. verdad. Eh, ¿Cuánto yes. tiempo estarás? No Spanish. They are all in the past tense. You mm, see that all, all of the questions are did, 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 did. All of them are in the past. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I came back last week. No. Um, no. Bien. La pasaste bien. No Spanish. Mm. Yes, it must was bien. great. Okay. No, no mm. Spanish. Yes, it, yes, it was great. It was great. Mm -hmm. Great. Yes, it, yes, was, great. it was great. <coughs> when do you come back? Um, when did you come? G, I come back I come last week. Back last came week. Back. Uh -huh. G, uh -huh. I yes, came. G. I came back last week. How much did you spend? I spent. I, I spent. Um, how do you say it? Ten thousand dollars. Ten thousand dollars. $10,000. Excellent. Mm -hmm. So easy to connect because go, where did you go? I went, went when? in German. Why did you go? This one is different verb because you have I was on vacation. But the others stayed. Where did you stay? I stayed. Okay, mm -hmm. how long did you stay? I stayed. Did you go? I went. No, I went. Did you see? I saw. Did you meet? I met or I didn't meet. What did you eat? I ate. Did you drink? I drank. Have had. Did you have a good time? It was great. It's the only one that is different. Well, two are different. Come back, came back. Spend. Spend. So you have the same verb. 
in that case, it's easy to manage. Okay, excellent. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, Thank you. Let's, let's go to the principal group. Let's go to the main group. The other one, we're going to leave it for later because of time. Okay, teacher. Okay, teacher. There are 10 people out, we're missing five, five people. Okay, this one, we're going to leave it for last. We're going to move on to the next one, but this one you have to do similar, similar to this, only with your imagination. Where did you go? I went to Argentina. Why did you go? Uh, I was on business. Where did you stay? I stayed, and you say the name of the hotel. Of course, you invent it. Or if it's real, good. But if it's invented, it's OK. You can use your imagination. We're going to do it later. Now, let's continue. Hotel amenities. Hotel amenities. The purpose is to discuss hotel amenities. And you say, teacher, what's an amenity? Over here, you have amenities is in plural. What's an amenity? It says that is the characteristics, the features of the hotel that are available for guests to use. Example, gym, pool, minibar, jacuzzi, okay, a special shampoo, special toothpaste, a liquor, maybe the bedrolls, etc. So the things that you have there. Okay. So those are the amenities. Later, we're going to have a list of amenities. The accommodation is the hotel, the, the bed and breakfast, or if you stay at a boarding house, or you stay with relatives, then you say that is accommodation. Okay. <laughs> I didn't notice that there was this picture in this room. Okay, so, well, but don't worry, it's not, it's not showing anything, so it's only a little, okay. So, this, uh, this is a list of amenities. the characteristics that, are, that you can use in the hotel, that characteristics that they present you with. Toiletries, toiletries is not only the toilet and the toilet paper, no. They are everything that have to do with you being clean. So, shampoo, lotion, aftershave, et cetera, toiletries. Personal care, combs, shaving cream, razor blade, electric, electric razor, shower cap for the people that cover their hair and they don't wash it, okay. hair dryer, the thing that dries your hair. So, personal care. Coffee kit. They have a, a coffee maker. The pot with the filter, with the coffee and everything. Coffee maker. Coffee and creamer. Creamer is the coffee mate. The white thing that you ate, that you add to the Coffee. I prefer to use milk rather than creamer. Tissue box. Tissue. 
There is a box that is cut in the open and you take out tissues to clean your face. Tissue, bathrobes and slippers. Teacher, bathrobes, yes. When you put on, you go to the shower, you put on a bathrobe. And the slippers are those soft shoes that people wear inside when they get up, puffy, uh, a little shaggy and very, very comfortable. So that is slippers. Okay. Let me see if I can if I can draw the slippers, the slippers, the slippers. Okay. Slippers. Get the idea, right? Yes? Unas chanclas. <laughs> yes, maybe. Pantufla. Uh huh. Slippers. These are slippers. Okay. Then the bathrobe is something like this. La bata. The bata. Bang. Yes, Sabata. Oh. Okay. Wow, Buen dibujante, teacher. <laughs> okay. Thank you, sir. So this is the bathrobe. Okay. Then free breakfast. You don't have to pay for breakfast. But it's included in the price. When they say B and B, bed and breakfast, you pay for the bed and you pay for breakfast. So they say free breakfast, free breakfast. You already pay, right? Pillows, option for pillows. Teacher, what's a pillow? This one, you put it to put your bed, your head when you sleep. Yeah. Almohada. Almohada. That's a pillow. Uh -huh. Then free Wi-Fi internet access. Okay. Free Wi-Fi internet access. So they only ask for the password. They give you the password and then you connect. Free parking. Obviously, you have to stay there for free parking. Premium coffee. Uh, Folgers, no, Folgers. Juan Valdez, they say. No. Okay. So they give you coffee, gym, or fitness center. Okay. So you go to a gym to do exercise, right? Then spa or jacuzzi. Teacher, what is that? Something like this. Jacuzzi. Uh -huh. That normally you enter here and this is full of water. It has hot water and you are relaxing in the hot water. The hot water gives you a massage, right? Jacuzzi is an Italian Italian invention. Jacuzzi. Only in Italian they say Jacuzzi is an Italian invention. Okay. So a stereo, you have a stereo system to listen to music. You have a television with cable, air conditioning. Uh, most of the time now you have Netflix, you have uh, Disney Plus, HBO, and 
Max Cine, Cinemax and HBO. You have, uh, what's the name of the other one? Paramount, Paramount. And you have the other one uh, that is Fox Plus. You have Fox Plus, you have all of those things. Of course, if you are in the suite, in a suite, you have uh, all of those things. Disney Plus, uh, Fox Plus, uh, HBO. Uh, what's the name of the other one? Movie, uh, cinema. Okay. And um, all of those for you to watch TV. So that is an idea. And you have cable TV also. Cable TV. So for you to relax. Amenities. Which of these amenities do you think you would probably use? Which of these hotel hotel amenities would you probably use? Toiletries. Ah, um, yes. Personal care. Personal care, right? Mm -hmm. Pillows. Pillows. Uh -huh, the pillows. Pillows. Yes. <laughs> Free Wi-Fi and free parking. Okay. In my case, if I am traveling, probably I would not have my car. So I would not be using free parking. Mm -hmm. Coffee kit is very important for me to share. The coffee kit, right? Yes. Yeah. And the bar too. Yeah, the mini bar. Okay. Yeah. In the yeah. bag or jacuzzi. Yes. Very important for relax. For relaxing, yeah. Mm -hmm. That would be nice too. Free, free Wi Fi, breakfast. free Wi Fi internet. Because yes. if you have Wi Fi, you can. Uh, send messages to your family from the hotel. Uh, the last time I traveled was in 2005. To, to call my family, I had to walk like uh, five uh, blocks to a telephone. And then I called from there, from a pay telephone. So that was dif different. Okay. Let's see. Okay. So you would use this one, this one, this one. Bathrooms and slippers, I usually don't, but maybe to be inside the hotel, maybe the slippers. Okay. And the, obviously the free breakfast. The pillows, extra pillows. No, I don't like too many pillows. No. No. Obviously the Wi Fi, the coffee, right? 11. And of course, uh, maybe not. When you are traveling, you don't go to the gym. You wait until you come back. So I go <laughs> to the gym again when I come back. Okay, this one, yes. The jacuzzi, yeah. Okay. So maybe those hotel amenities. Are hotel amenities important? Yes. Yes, right. Yes. They make the yes. trip more attractive. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. We're going to practice this conversation. Practice the following conversation. Radisson, San Jose, Costa Rica. How may I help you? 
Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm traveling to your country on April 14th. Certainly, ma'am. May I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Joanne Dreyfus. Thank you, Ms. Dreyfus. How long are you planning to stay? Only for three nights. How would you like to pay? Our rate is $92 a night, a total of $276. Okay. I'll pay by credit card, MasterCard. Very well. Are you going to pay now or on arrival? On arrival, certainly. Will you be needing your our shuttle service? No, thanks. I'm coming in by taxi. Would you like us to call you one? No, thanks. I took care of that already. Very well. Have a safe, safe trip. We'll be waiting for you. Teacher, what's a shuttle service? Is transportation from the airport to the hotel, right? The shuttle service. Okay, so Radisson, San Jose, Costa Rica. How may I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm traveling to your country on April 14th. Certainly, ma'am. May I have your name, please? Of course. I'm Joanne Dreyfus. Thank you, Ms. Dreyfus. How long are you planning to stay? Only for three nights. How would you like to pay? Our rate is $92 a night, a total of $276. I'll pay by credit card, MasterCard. Very well. Are you going to pay now or on arrival? On arrival, certainly. Will you be needing our shuttle service? No, thanks. I'm coming in by taxi. Would you like us to call you one? No, thanks. I took care of that already. Very well. Have a safe trip. We'll be waiting for you. Hey, how may I help you? I need a reservation for a single room. I'm traveling to your country on April 14th. Certainly, mom. Certainly, mom. May I have your name, please? Of course. Thank you. How long are you planning to stay? How would you like to pay? Our rate is $92 a night, a total of $276. I'll pay by credit card, MasterCard. Very well. Are you going to pay now or on arrival? On arrival. Certainly. Will you be needing our shuttle service? No, thanks. I'm coming in by taxi. Would you like us to call you one? No, thanks. I took care of that already. Very well. Have a safe trip. We'll be waiting for you. Hey, do you have questions? Repeat again, please, certainly. 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 Cert Cert certainly. 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 Cert certainly. Certainly. Okay. Okay, certainly. Okay, certainly, mom. Certainly, mom. Okay, of course, of course. So I'll, let's go to the groups and let's practice. The groups are opening, please join and let's practice the conversation. Florcita is here, excellent. Hello. Hi. Yes. Okay. 
<clears throat> we can see. Okay, I am perception. And Ken, John, Ken was it John? Who Ken John? Joan. Joan. Juan. Johan. Joan. 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 Johan is a German name. Johannes is Juan. Joan. 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 I be a section. Ok, voy a ser Joan. ¿Quién quiere ser Perception? Ah, Ivy. Perception. Ok. Radisson, San José, Costa Rica. How may I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm traveling to you, to your country on April. 14. Certainly, mom. Mom. <laughs> May I have your name, please? Of course. I'm Johan Dreyfus. Thank you, Miss Dreyfus. Joan, oh. Joan Dreyfus. Joan Dreyfus. I am Joan Dreyfus. Thank you, Miss Dreyfus. How long are you planning to stay? Only for three nights. How would you like to pay? Or oh, rate? Oh, pardon, sorry. Or rate is nineteen two a night, a total of two hundred seventeen six. Credit card, Mastercard. Very well. Are you going to pay now or on arrival? On arrival. Certainly. Will you be needed or sure, sure service? service? No, thanks. I'm coming with taxi. Would I ask to call you one? No, thanks. I took care of that already. Very well. Have a safe trip. We'll be waiting for you. Oh, sorry. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Muy bien. Empiezo yo ahí con reception. ¿Quién me apoya? Yo. Okay. Radisson, San José. Thank you, Miss. The the force. Oh, I don't know. Johan Johan Dreyfus. Dreyfus. Miss Miss Dreyfus. How long are you? Planning to stay. Planning, planning to stay. Planning to stay. Only for three nights. How would you like to play to pay our right? Our rate. Right is is nine nineteen two a nine a total. ¿Cómo se lee, teacher? Two hundred seventy six dollars. No, no, no. Um, a total. A total. A total, a total, a total, a total, a total of two hundred seventy six dollars. Uh -huh. Two hundred seven. Six dollars. Seventy six. Seventy six dollars. Okay. Well, 
pay by credit card MasterCard. Very well. Are you going to pay now or on arrive, arrival? On uh, arrival? Centrally. Huh? Will you be needing our shuttle, shuttle service? Shuttle service. No, thank Would, would you like us to call you one? I took care of that already. Very well, has a say threat will be waiting for you. Make I make I have your name, please. Of course, um, you am trifle. Thank you, Miss Trifle. You long are you planning to stay? Only for three nights. Oh, how do you like to play? Or read is how would, you, to, how would you like to pay? How would we? How, uh -huh. how would you like to pay? How would you like to play? Or pay, read pay. is how would, you like, how would you like to pay? How would you like to do? To pay. To play. Pay. Pay. Play, no, pay. To pay. Pay. Our weight is pay. $92 a night. All right. Weight. Our weight. Our weight is $92 a night. $92. $92, $92. a night. A night. $92 a night. A total of two hundred seventy six dollars. Uh huh. Two hundred seventy six dollars. I pay by credit card, Mastercard. Very well. Are you going to pay? To pay now? Are to pay now or on travel? Arrival. On arrival. Arrival. On the arrival. Oh, on arrival. Certainly. Oh, no, second. Certainly. Certainly. Yes, teacher. Certainly. 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 Will you be? Will you be? Needing? Will you Will be? Will you be? Needing. Needing or taking service. Shadow. Sharon, Sharon service. service. Sa Sharon service. No thanks. I coming in by taxi. Would you like us to call? Would you, you like us? One? Would you like us to call you one? Would you like us to call you to one? No thanks. I took care of that already. I took care, took care of that already. I took care of took, that. Took, 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 I took, I took care of that already. Already, 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 already. Very well. Yep. I say trip will be washing for you. Uh -huh. 
will be waiting. Well, waiting. We'll be waiting. We'll be waiting. waiting. Waiting we, for you. We we be wearing waiting for you. Okay. Next. Okay. Ready, son San Jose, Costa Rica. Home. My young my, I have your name, please. Oh, cool. Are you Andreifus? Thank you, my Dreyfus. How long, how long are you planning to Miss, stay? Miss Dreyfus. Miss Dreyfus. <laughs> Only for three nights. How would you like to say? How, how would you like to pay? How would you like to pay? All right. Our rate is maybe two dollars a night. A dollar of total, two, a total, a total of two hundred seventy six dollars. Excellent. I'll, I'll pay by credit card, MasterCard. Very well. Are you going to pay no or on arrival? Arrival. Arrival. On arrival. Entry. Certainly. Entry. Will you be needing or short service? No, thanks. I coming in by taxi. Coming in and coming in by taxi. I coming in by taxi. Would you like would you to call would you like us? Would, would you like, like us? us? Would you would you like us you to call? To call you one. To call you one. To call you one. Call you one. No thanks. I took care of that already. Very well. How a five script. Safe, well, safe trip. trip. A safe trip. A safe trip. Will okay. be waiting for you. Thank you. Next. Thank you. Ya pasamos. Va? Yo creo que sí. Seven people are out. Okay. Now everybody's out. Let's see. Let's continue. Say if the statements below are true or false. Joanne needs a double room. True. False. False, right? False. No. So the first one is false. Joanne is planning to stay for three nights. True. It's a true. 
It's true. It's true. It's true. Yes. Joan is traveling alone. It's true. 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 Joan is going to rent a car at the airport. Four. 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 Joan will be paying in cash. Four. 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 Okay, discuss the following questions. What are hotel amenities? Can you list five hotel amenities? Which do you think are the most popular? Which ones do you use when you travel? And why are the amenities important? Okay. Why are the amenities important? Okay. This this place here is or this cove here is in following 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 is in in Greece. Is in Greece, Grecia, right? Greece. Okay. Greece. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's see, my dear. Let's go to the group so you can discuss the question. Groups are opening. Please join. Okay, discuss the following question. Number one, what are hotel amenities? Shampoo, soap. Yes. <laughs> Free Wi-Fi, internet. Wi-Fi. Toilet kits. Yes. And um, Wi-Fi. Free Wi-Fi. Coffee kit. Toallas, ¿cómo se dice en inglés? Towels. 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 Aire acondicionado. Air conditioners. Air conditioning. Air conditioning. Air conditioning. TV. TV. ¿De hecho, el servicio al cuarto, cómo se dice? Room service. Room service. Room service. Okay. Only, that, only that that is a service. In that case, it's not an amenity, but it's a service. Okay, number two. Can you list five hotel amenities? I don't know. Ya los enumeramos. Can you... Ya los enumeramos. Ah. No, ah. no, los hoteles. Cuando sea algún hotel que sea de lujo, no, yo no sé, I don't know. No, pero ahí que no vamos a enumerar los servicios del hotel. Can you list? Oh, espera. Okay. Cinco hoteles. No. Can you o list five hotel. hotel amenities? Hotel ah. amenities. Not the hotels, the amenities. Amenities in a hotel, hotel amenities. And you mentioned already, uh, they are different from the services. Services is one thing, amenities is something different. For example, you have the gym. The gym is not a service. The gym, is an amenity. You have access to the amenities. The services are given to you. 
they give you the services and the amenities are there for you. You use the amenities and they give you the services. Like for example, room service is not an amenity, it's a service, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. okay, so mm -hmm. that, that would be a, a different thing. Uh, the chair. Uh, air conditioner is principal. Yes, air conditioning is an amenity, yes. And uh, amenities is similar to extras of the hotel. The principals. Yeah, could be. Hot mm. water enter. Hot water, yes, hot water. Yes. Yeah. It's an amenity. Some hotels, well, I think that most of the hotels have a double bulb. So you have a yeah. double, uh, they call it, they have water, hot water and cold water. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think so in in our country, uh, hot water is no important, but if I travel to USA in winter, it's very important, important hot water. Yeah, depends on the on the part of the United States. On uh, winter? In winter time, it depends in the in what area of the United States. North States. Uh -huh, but in the northern states, eastern states. Okay. Yeah. Because there are some <laughs> states that even in winter are hot. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But teacher, but yes. in winter, for example, in Arizona, it's very cold. In, Arizona, in the mountains. Very... Remember yeah. that Arizona is desertic. Hmm. Yeah. So in, if you go to the mountains, all the time of the cold. year is cold. Cold. Uh -huh. But in the valley, no. it's the desert is super hot. Yes. <laughs> it's hot. But, if you, because but, that is but, central state. But there, there is a, there is one difference. And for example, uh, in Arizona. In the mountains, uh, fall fall snow. In, <laughs> in the in the valley, it's the same, but but it's it's cold. It's cold. Uh, the the mountain fall fall in the valley, cold, free. Yes, the the valley is cold at night. Yeah, yeah. So night. all all night is super yes. cold, but during the day yes. it's hot. It's a desert. It's hot. Mm -hmm. That's right. So That's right. Las, Las Vegas, Las Vegas, Arizona, and all of that are super. New desert. Mexico. Uh -huh. Part of New Mexico. Yeah. Texas, but Texas, Texas can be cold. Some parts of Texas are cold. Some parts yes. of Miami are cold, but normally it's hot. Ah, if you go to even Georgia, it's cold, but Georgia is south. In the north, like uh, Boston, Detroit, Chicago. Massachusetts. North, yeah, they are. Massachusetts, yeah, it's kind of central. It's, Okay, not so high, but okay. But yes. It's, yes, it's cold already. Yeah, Massachusetts is already cold. Um, okay, teacher. But anyhow, it depends, no? What part of the United States you travel. Cold water, but it's funny, like you say <laughs> in winter time, but not only winter time. If you get up at four o'clock in the morning, you use Hot water. Hot water. Even in El Salvador. <laughs> <laughs> in Puerto La Libertad, San Miguel. Yeah. Oh. Yes, I use water hot. <laughs> you, use hot. Water. <laughs> <laughs> you go to Costa Rica, for example. Costa Rica, well, 
the place that I went to Costa Rica was in how how is the weather? How is the weather in Costa Rica? Uh, San Jose is hot, but it's hot. I went to the high part in Alajuelo, the mountain, and then the temperature was cold. Oh, yes. we need a hot water to take a shower. Yes, <laughs> yes. you have two faucets. With the faucets, you open both faucets and the water is mixed. It's kind of not so hot, not so cold. And if you open the faucet more, there is more water, so it's colder. If you open it a little, it's less water and it's warmer. So I, I don't like hot water. Any place that I go, I use cold water because it wakes me up. But my friends, all of them use hot water. <laughs> <laughs> yes. No, I prefer to wake up with cold water. Quickly, you wake up. Yes. So. Yes. Mm -hmm. You have to get up at five o'clock in the morning. So you have to be awake for the classes and everything. So it's nice. Okay. Which do you think are the most popular amenities in your opinion? For example, Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi, yes. Wi-Fi is popular. TV. Television, yes. Television and cable TV, Netflix and all of the streaming services. Air conditioning. Air conditioning. Air conditioning. Yeah. Free coffee. Ah, free coffee. Of course. <laughs> Everybody free loves coffee. free coffee. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Okay. Excellent. Continue, my friend. Continue. Okay. Uh, important. Yes, because, because. No Spanish, please. The client yes. recommend and the people, verdad? Yes. The recommendation, el oso, diga. <laughs> <laughs> there are children present. There are children present, please. <laughs> I am here. Come on. <laughs> Rolando, Rolando, behave, please, behave. <laughs> for, for better comfort. Ah, uh, exactly, for more comfort, right? For more comfort. They are necessary for, or they are important for more comfort. Mm -hmm. You finish, right? Yes, teacher. Excellent. Yes. Let me check the, the other group and then we go to the main group. I'm going to change, I'm going to close this because of the music. You finish, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, teacher. Excellent. Yes, teacher. Solo que nos habíamos así como quedado. Bueno, estábamos pensando todo, ¿verdad? Con la pregunta, no, eh, question number five. Eh, a mí, a amenities. Why are the amenities important? Ajá, ¿eso qué significa amenities? Es que teníamos dudas, como como decir algo así. Mi niñitos chulos, ya lo habíamos visto, se acuerdan. No me pusieron atención. Okay. 
go to number 11. No, 12 is right. The next one, sorry, the next one. 12. No, that's 10. 12, that one. Okay, amenities you have here. Like we said, the characteristics of the hotel that are available for guests to use. The gym, the pool, the minibar, the jacuzzi. Mm -hmm. And we made a list in number 10. In number 10, we made a list. We said shampoo, the coffee kit, the mini bar, this the gym or fitness, uh, the fitness center, the jacuzzi, the free breakfast, the pillows, the bathroom slippers, the tissue box, all of these are amenities. The amenities are the extras that the hotel has. And the services are what the workers of the hotel provide. Like the, the services are dry cleaning, laundry, Right, they do the laundry, they, they, they do the cleaning, room service, turn down, the turn down service that is like they prepare the bed for the people to use it. So that would be the other things, but that is not. But this is amenities are the characteristics, the extra characteristics that the hotel has for the people to use them when they stay in the hotel. Mm -hmm. So the people who like to drink uh, mini bars, the people who like and sometimes there are amenities like a swimming pool. They have a swimming pool or in the rooms they have spa, jacuzzi uh, and services would be massage. They give a massage that is a service, it's not an amenity. A ballet and parking, that is a, a service because there is a driver that parks the cars. Shuttle is a service because it has a driver. Okay, so when there are people, there are services. When there are only objects or things, amenities. So shampoo, slippers, baths, uh, okay, all of those are amenities. For the toiletries, you have toothpaste, shampoo, lotion, deodorant, and et cetera. Mm -hmm. That would be the, the idea. Okay, I think that you finished, right? Yes, teacher. Yes, let's go to the yes. Thank you, Mr. You're welcome. Let's go to the main room. Mm -hmm. Ten people. Let's wait for the other people. Ten people. We're waiting for six people. Okay, people are out. Let's continue. Okay, when we talk about hotel services, we have the lobby. Uh, the lobby is a large area near the reception. There are sofas, okay, that are comfortable. They, they are usually playing lounge music. 
for the people to relax. So guests can go to the lobby, sit down, read a book, okay? Just relax listening to the music that is in the lounge, okay? Or you can wait for visitors in the lobby. So I was waiting in the lobby when I saw her coming to the reception desk. Reception, a desk at the hotel where visitors or guests are received. At the reception, you book a room. They give you the, the key, if it's a traditional key or an electronic key. Sometimes it's only a card. So you have like, with the card, the door opens automatically. Okay, so at the reception, hotel guests may ask for Wi-Fi password at the reception desk. All inclusive, an all inclusive resort is a holiday resort, a vacation resort that includes a minimum of three meals daily, drinks and other services in the price. Example, without propaganda, uh, what's the name of the hotel that they make a lot of publicity here in our country? Royal, Royal the Camarón. De, de Camarón, right? So, okay. so in the Royal de Camarón, they have like uh, a, the all inclusive. They give you all the meals, so you enter at night and you go out in the morning, or you go, you enter in the afternoon and you go out like one p.m. They give you dinner all the food that you can eat, all the drinks that you can enjoy, you can go swimming, you can do, so that is all inclusive, all inclusive. Uh, I don't remember how much it costs. It used to cost like about $150 uh, one night and you left the next day. I don't know now, okay? But what with $150, you go somewhere and you eat three days, four days, five days. Okay. But some people spend uh, that money on one night. So it's another story. Okay, bed and breakfast. A private home where guests are provided overnight accommodations and serve breakfast, but usually no other meals, only breakfast. The people get there in the evening. They don't receive dinner. They only are welcome. And then they have a bed. And the next day, they have breakfast. Only that. I stayed in a bed and, break and breakfast in Costa Rica. I didn't eat dinner because they don't eat dinner and they didn't give me breakfast. I asked them, and the breakfast? Hey, no, we don't have breakfast, they said. But yours, it says, bed and breakfast. Ah, yes, it's the name, but we don't have. Hey, it's okay. I had to go and buy the breakfast somewhere else. Okay, so they stayed at a bed and breakfast near the Eiffel Tower, B and B, B and B, bed and breakfast. Single room, a room in a hotel that has a bed for one adult. Suite, suite, a number of connected rooms in a hotel forming one living unit. The multimillionaire is staying at the Royal Suite. The Royal Suite has a very big, uh, well, it's a big room, a big bedroom has a bathroom, has a closet, a walk-in closet, et cetera. So it's, it's a suite, it's very big. Okay, these are services. Do you have questions about these ones? The lobby, reception, all-inclusive, bed and breakfast, single room, 
sweet questions? No questions. Okay. Then this is a list of the services. Car rental service. Catering service. Teacher, what is catering? If you go to a convention in a hotel, they bring the food for everybody in the convention. That's catering, catering service. They provide the food and the drinks. Concierge services. That is cleaning, cleaning services and uh, some repairs and stuff like concierge okay that would be a service too courier services uh, you they send if you want to send a package from the hotel to a friend you pay and they send the the package so they have courier services doctor on call if you're feeling sick you call and they send you a doctor dry cleaning so if you need to uh, keep your suit good looking in perfect conditions, you can use the dry cleaning serve. Ballet parking, they park your car. Excursions and guided tours. So they can give you trips to different uh, tourist destinations in the country. Flower arrangements they can arrange flowers and send them to a room that you specify. Ironing service, they iron, they iron your clothes. Laundry and valet service. So laundry, they, if your clothes is dirty, they wash it for you. Mail services, they, they send you letters or messages that are for you. Massages, they give you a massage, right? Turn down service, they prepare the bed for you to sleep. They roll down the linen for you to sleep. Room service, 24 hours. So you call them and you say, I want breakfast. They send you breakfast. I want dinner, they send you dinner. Whatever you want, they call you call room service and they send you shoe shine service. If you need your shoes to be cleaned, they shine your shoes. Ticket service. Okay, so for ticket service, okay, for different uh, uh, for the ballet, for the opera, for other things, you can get tickets there. Transfer and chauffeur driven or transfer and chauffeur driven limousine service. They have a limousine, you ask them and they take you wherever you want to go. Spa and jacuzzi for you to take a hot bath. So you have, these are hotel, hotel services. You say teacher, but you say that the spa and the jacuzzi was an amenity, yes? It's an amenity, uh, but it's also a service. Why a service? Because many times there is a person in charge of the jacuzzi, they prepare it, they add spices, flowers, petals of flowers, deodorants, and I don't know what else. So for aromatherapy, for that reason, it's also a service. What hotel services do you use when you travel? Okay, if you don't travel, what services do you like and you would probably use? Car rental service. Okay, yes, the car rental service, okay. Another one that you- Mail would... service. Sorry? A mail service. Ah, mail services, okay. Mm -hmm. Room service, 24 hours. Room service, 24 hours, okay. Dry cleaning. Dry cleanings. Mm -hmm. 
Ballet parking. Ballet, uh -huh, ballet parking, yes. Uh -huh. I had breakfast. I uh have -huh, the breakfast, right? So you would uh, ask for room service. Uh -huh. Okay. The ones that I would not use is shoe shine because it's very expensive. You would believe it that shoe shine is so expensive at a hotel. Okay. And also the limousine service. Okay. Well, at a hotel, everything is expensive. But there are some things that are even more expensive. Okay. Let's see. Car rental services. Ironing service. Turn down service. They make the bed ready for you. And even they put a chocolate on, on top of your pillow. Right? They put a candy. And if, if some people ask, there is a person that sits next to you and reads a story for you, for you to sleep. <laughs> it's funny, no? But it's a service. You say, I want a lady to come and read a story for me. Okay? And then they go and get a book. The, the lady sits next to your bed she covers you and then she tells, reads a story for you to sleep. And then she goes and closes the door for you to sleep. Okay, it's a service, okay? Turn down service. Catering service. So they, they provide the food. Laundry, okay? They wash your clothes. Concierge service, okay? That includes the bellboy, etc. So these are some services. Okay, let's practice the conversation. Hello, Marcus. What are you doing? Packing. Packing? Why? Are you traveling somewhere? I am. I have a convention in Edmonton, Canada you and your conventions. You didn't tell me. You know what I think? No. What? You're going on vacation and don't want to take me. Come on, my darling. Do you think I would do something like that? No. I'm sure. Man, man, man. I'd never do something like that. What services are you going to request? Only ironing and car rental. So you won't be needing these trunks, will you? Now, that's in case I go swimming. Yeah, right. Okay. Let's see. Hello, Marcos. What are you doing? Packing. Packing? Why? Are you traveling somewhere? I am. I have a convention in Edmonton, Canada. You and your convention. You didn't tell me. You know what I think? No. What? You're going on vacation and don't want to take me. Come on, my darling. Do you think I would do something like that? No. I'm sure. Man, man, man. I'd never do something like that. What services are you going to request? Only ironing and car rental. So you won't be needing these trunks, will you? No. Now, that's in case I go swimming. Yeah, right. Okay. What do you think is the relationship between Mirna and Marcos? They are married. Do you think it is possible? Yeah. Because he, she enters and says, hello, Marcos, what are you doing? So do you think that she lives in the same house with Marcos? Yes. Or are they only boyfriend, girlfriend? 
maybe. Yeah, but if they were boyfriend girlfriend, she would not say, "You don't want to date me," right? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. So maybe they are married. Maybe they are a new couple. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Do you have questions about the conversation? No question. It's clear. It's clear. Okay. Let's practice. Let's go to the conversation and let's practice together. Okay. The groups are opening. Please join and, and practice. Okay, yes. hello Marcos. What are you doing? Packing. Packing? Why? Are you traveling somewhere? I am. I have a convention convention in Edmonton, Edmonton, Canada. You and your convention. You didn't tell me. You know what I think? No, what? You're going on vacation and don't want to take me. Come on, my darling. Do you think I will, I will do something like that? No, I'm sure, man, man. I'd never do something like that. What service are you going to request? Only ironing and tar printer. So you won't be needing these tools, will you? No, that's not. That's in case I go swimming. Yeah, right. Okay, thank you. Next. Thank you. Break it, break it. Only ironing. No? And car rental. So you you won't be need the this drug, will you? No, that's in case I'm going swimming. Yeah, right. Next. Next. Okay, um, floor. Hello, Marcos. What are you doing? Parking. Parking. Why are you traveling somewhere? I am. I had a convention in Edmonton. Edmonton. No sé cómo pronuncia. Canada. Edmond. Edmonton. Ed Edmonton, Canada. You and your conventions, you did not tell me you know what I think? No, what? You're going on vacation and don't want to take me? Come oh, on, oh my darling. Do you think I will do something like that? No, I'm sure, man, man. I never do something like that. What service are you going to request? Only 
I run, I run, I run, and um, car rental. I run in car rental. I run in car rental. So you want to figure? Yo, pero no sé quién me va. Porque yo quedé Yo le puedo seguir. Yo le puedo okay. ayudar. Ok, ok. Thank you. Um, hello, Marcos. What are you doing? Packing. What are you doing? Packing. Doing, doing. What are you doing? Doing. <laughs> packing packing why are you traveling some somewhere somewhere I am at a convention in Edmond, Canada you and your convention you didn't tell me you know what I think? No, what? Hello, Marcos, what are you doing? Packing. Packing, why? Are you traveling somewhere? I am. I have a convention in El Monton, Canada. You and your convention. You need it. You didn't tell me. You know what I think. No, what? You're going on vacation and don't want to tell me. Come on, my darling. Do you think I will do something like that? Something, something like something, that. Something, something like that? No, I ain't sure. Man to man. You never do something like that? What service are you going to request? Only, I don't mean a car rental. So you won't be needing this trunks, will you? No, that's in case I go swimming. Yeah, right. Okay. Okay. Next. Okay, I want you to look this one. What do you think this is? We have the options, shuttle service, business center, single room, fridge in the room, wake up call, safe, Wi-Fi internet, laundry service. Wake up. Okay, so number one is wake up, wake up call, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, only that a wake up call. <laughs> I imagine that the guy is still in bed, right? He's in bed and he answers, huh? Oh, okay, thank you. And he wakes up. Okay. So, what's number two? Laundry service. Laundry service. Laundry service. Number three? Fridge in the room. Fridge, fridge in the room. Number four. Business center. 
maybe it's a business center. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And what about five? Safe. Safe, right? Safe. Yeah, safe. Number six. Shuttle, shuttle service. Number six. Single room. Single room. Even though there are two pillows, it looks uh, more like a double room. But yeah, it's single room. Uh -huh. Why single? Okay. Normally, you have a single room. It's a bed that is narrow, has only one pillow for one person. And uh, a wide bed with two pillows is for two people. So it's a double room. Normally, double rooms are for married people. Right? Okay, thank you. And the single Mr. rooms are for single people. <laughs> okay. Let's see. What about seven? Shuttle service. service. Shuttle service. In number eight? Wi Fi. Wi Fi. Wi Fi. Okay. Let's see. We're going to be matching this. This is something that we're going to be doing. Good evening. Would you like a single room? How may I help you? How long will you be staying? When will you be arriving? When will you be leaving? What's your name, please? How will you be paying? How do you spell your last name? That will be $600 for two nights. May I have your credit card number, please? Please repeat the CVV. What is the CVV? The, the uh, let's say credit validation, uh, validation something. Okay, so like it's a this number two one three four. Okay, so let's see. We have for two nights. On Wednesday, Johann Schmidt, no, a double room, please. Schmidt, S-C-H-M-I-D-T. Good evening. All right, thanks. I'd like to make a reservation tomorrow night by credit card. Gladly, 21339. Sure, it's 3451 four, nine, We'll say like that. Okay, so how do we match number one? F. The one is the F. F, right. Yeah. Okay. F good, evening. Good, evening. good evening. Good evening. I will, uh, good evening. Okay. okay. Would you like a single room? D, no, a double room, please. No, a double room, please, yes. How may I help you? I'd like to make a reservation, please. I'd like to make a reservation. Uh, I'd like to make a reservation. Now, age. Age. Mm -hmm. How long will you be staying? For two nights. For two eight. nights, age for two nights. When will you be arriving? Wednesday. When will you be arriving? On Wednesday. On Wednesday. Mm -hmm. When will you be leaving? No, 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 this is not. This is when will you be leaving? So, Let's say, when will you be arriving? Mm -hmm. Tomorrow night. Yeah, tomorrow tomorrow night. night. When will you be leaving? On Wednesday. On Wednesday. Uh -huh. What's your name, please? Johan yeah. Smith. Johan Smith. 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 Johan Schmidt. Uh, how will you be paying? La eight. Eight. Credit card. Yeah. No. Uh -huh. um, How will you be paid by credit card? By credit card. How will you? How do you spell your last name? E. La e. 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 E
S S A M I D T. That will be six hundred dollars for two nights. All right, thanks. All right, thanks. All right, thanks. May I have your credit card number, please? Sure. It's sure. Five one four. Okay, excellent. Please repeat the C B V. Gladly. Lady. C B V. Gladly. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Yeah. All right. So that would be big. Okay. All right. With this, like, we had this one. Okay. Only let's read it for the time and then we're going to go. Okay, practice the conversation. Good evening, Hotel Hotel San Buenaventura. How may I help? Um, I would like to make a reservation. Certainly, sir. May I have your name, please? Yes, it's Michael Chong. C-H-O-N-G, yes. What day will you be arriving? I will be arriving on March 28th. How long will you be staying? I'll be staying for three nights. How many people will be staying in the room? Just me. I will be staying in the room alone. Would you like a smoking or a non-smoking room? I'd like a non-smoking room, please. We have booked a room for Michael Chung for three nights. Please be sure to arrive before 4 p.m. on March the 28th. I'll do that. Thanks. Okay. We don't have time to practice, but this is the conversation. Okay. And uh, we stop here. All right. Attendance. Let's go to the attendance. Alison Andrea Serrano. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Anna nice. Geraldine Mena. Good night. Present. Excellent. Barbara Susana Rivas. Blanca Flor Jimenez. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Carla Jasmine Rivera. Present. Excellent, very good. Carlos Jonathan Garcia. No, right. he didn't come. Daniel Ernesto Membreño. Present, good night. Good night. Denis Fernando Flamenco. Present, sir. See you tomorrow. Excellent. Nice, see you tomorrow. Edwin Mauricio Pineda Lobo. No, Edwin, today. Gilberto Benito Santa Maria. Present teacher. Good night. Good night. Be good. Jose Andres Martinez. Jose Andres. No, didn't come. Okay. Kathy Briseida Hernandez. Present. Excellent. Nice. Noé Gustavo Núñez. Present teacher. Good Excellent. night. Excellent. Nice. Good night. Olga Tatiana Portillo. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Oliver Van Trigueros. Omar Alexander Chavez. Don Omar. Not right. Didn't come. Okay, Roberto Carlos Gámez. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Rolando Danilo Sánchez. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Salvador Alberto Soriano. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Susana Andrea Urbina. Present teacher, good night. Good night, excellent. William Boris Roque. Present teacher, good night. Excellent, good night. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for attending today. I will be seeing you tomorrow. Okay, sleep well. Um, that would be nice if you did the homework.
you do the homework that you're missing and we finish soon. Okay, thank you for attending. Good night, my friends. Take care. Good night, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Good night, Good night. teacher. Bye-bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Good night. teacher. Bye. Good night. Take care. Be good. Good evening, Hotel San, Bu San Buenaventura. How may I help you? I would like to make a reservation. Certainly, sir. May I have your name, please? Yes, it's Michael Chong. C-H-O-N-G? Yes. What day will you be arriving? I will be arriving on March 28th. How long will you be staying? I'll be staying for three nights. How many people will be staying in the room? Just me. I will be staying in the room alone. Would you like a smoking or a non-smoking room? I'd like a non-smoking room, please. We have booked a room for Michael Chung for three nights. Please be sure to arrive before 4 p.m. on March 28th. I'll do that. Thanks. What do you think is better to spend uh, a vacation, the city or the mountains? In the city, you have a lot of places that you can visit. You can go shopping, you can visit famous monuments, churches, parks, and tourist destinations that otherwise you wouldn't see. In the mountains, you can enjoy a beautiful view of the city and also of other uh, wild life, right? So you can see animals, you can uh, see, let's say, things that you don't find in our country. Why do you think so? Well, I think so by experience. Talking about cities, you can find many amenities, many things that you can enjoy, but of course, the mountains, you can find peace, relaxation, and of course, fresh air. What activities can you do there? Well, if you go to the mountains, you can go camping, you can sleep uh, in a tent. At night, you can build a bonfire, play the guitar, sing your favorite tunes. And of course, if you're talking about the city, uh, there are many activities that you can do. One of them is sightseeing. You can be sightseeing throughout the city, taking pictures, maybe sh go shopping somewhere, uh, maybe sitting at, at a bench in a park, uh, just learning about the culture in the area. Maybe you can visit museums, uh, famous monuments, churches, parks, etc. in the city. Uh, you can get around, how can you get around there? Well, you can get around by car if you rent one, or you can get around by bus if the bus service is good in the area. But if the things are close by, you can walk from one place to another. Do you think it's cheaper or only more comfortable? Well, walking is not only cheaper, but it's also more comfortable. In some places in Europe, you can rent a bicycle and you can go by bicycle and you there is it takes you from one point to another point. You get it uh, five kilometers back and you can drop it off five kilometers ahead and then you can go walking just by yourself. What's the purpose of a vacation? Well, the vacation may have different purposes. Uh, for me, the most important is to recover the energies that you have invested in your work. Um, also, I think that not only resting is important, but also uh, many times after working a lot, you feel a kind of burnout. So you feel like um, because of stress or because of distraction, many times you cannot think of as many activities as you could if you were more relaxed. 
And uh, many times, if you spend most of the day busy, probably you can have, uh, let's say, more energy the next time that you re when you return from the vacation. Um, that is considering that if you stay at home on vacation and you sleep, you catch up, catch up on your sleep and you relax. But if you go out every night on vacation because you visit a, an exotic city somewhere, of course, when you return, you need a vacation from the vacation and you didn't rest enough. For this reason, I believe it's better to, if it's a vacation, maybe you can take a short trip somewhere near for just two days and the next of the days you can catch up on your energies you can relax so that when you get back uh, you are a new man when you go back to work so because the purpose of a vacation is to relieve stress okay to release stress and to get new energies okay and to get to work uh, like a new man so that is the purpose of a vacation okay to take a break and do something different than you do every day thank you remember that the amenities and the services are two different things the services are provided by people, while the amenities are the extras that the hotel has to offer. At the hotel, you have a gym, you have a jacuzzi, or you have a spa. These are amenities, but services are like room service, like ballet parking, catering, and massages if you get one. So these are services because these are provided by people. Services are provided by people. Amenities are part of the infrastructure of the hotel. Of course, there are some amenities that are acquired by the hotel for the comfort of their guests, such as lotion, perfume, deodorant, right? and maybe shampoo, uh, bath rub, slippers, towels, okay? All of these things that you find in the room already, because many times the hotels are all-inclusive, you will find all of these things. And in the all-inclusive, you can have room service and at any time of day, if you want breakfast or a snack, lunch or an afternoon snack or dinner, you just call and they come to your room and they bring it to you. So that is part of the service. And of course, there is like a turn down service in which they prepare your bed. They roll down the linen for you for the bed to be ready for you to sleep. And they leave you a candy, maybe a chocolate bar or something for you to snack before going to bed. And uh, in some of the hotels, uh, you have access to books. So you can pick up a book and read while uh, you sleep, right? No, no, before you sleep, while you sleep, you cannot read. Okay, so you can read uh, in before you fall asleep. Reading usually makes it easier for people to sleep because your mind clears up and you are up to sleeping. So that would be the idea in case of the hotel. So a reservation is, can be made by phone, right? Or you can make it on, a, on the internet, on a computer. You can place your reservation. And if you want, you, you can pay online. But if not, you can pay on arrival. And the amenities will be the extras that the hotel has. The services are all of those activities that are provided by the people who work in the hotel.
ಹೋಗ್ತೀವಿ